Hi guys, I hope you all are doing well and welcome to the next video of Microsoft Intune series. In the last video, we talked about Windows updates in Microsoft Intune. We talked about feature updates, quality updates. We talked about update rings and I demonstrated you how to create update ring policies to manage feature updates and quality updates on Windows devices. In this particular video, we are going to talk about enrollment notifications. We will understand the requirement of enrollment notifications, what type of enrollment notifications we can manage in Microsoft Intune, and I will demonstrate you practically how to set up enrollment notifications in Microsoft Intune. Enrollment notifications is a new feature that was introduced with the recent service release of Microsoft Intune. That was around last year. Enrollment notifications provide organizations with an easy method to notify the users whenever a new device is enrolled using their credentials. So this way, the end users can verify if the enrollment was genuine and if they find any suspicious enrollment with their credentials, they can report it to the administrators. Apart from this, the administrators can send a welcome message to the end users when they successfully enroll a device. In Microsoft Intune, you can create two type of notifications, email notifications and push notifications. By configuring the notifications, administrators can send notifications in emails and as a push notification on the company portal app. Before you start managing enrollment notifications, you should be aware of few things. Enrollment notifications are supported on Android devices or bring your own device scenarios on iOS or iPad devices for bring your own device scenario. You can use these notifications on Mac devices and Windows 10 or 11 devices, excluding hybrid Azure AD joined devices. One more thing that you need to consider is email notifications appear in the user's inbox and push notifications appear in the Intune company portal app for iOS or iPad, Mac operating system and Android devices. But the push notifications are not supported in company portal app for the Windows devices. Also, the enrollment notifications are supported with user driven enrollment scenarios. These notifications do not work on the devices. Those are enrolled by the administrators. And before you configure enrollment notifications in Microsoft Intune, make sure company branding and customization should be configured for your tenant. If you do not know how to customize your tenant and how to add company branding in Microsoft Intune portal, you can refer to the link that you can see on your screen. You will get all the information that is required to complete this particular task. So now let's move towards our lab and let's configure enrollment notifications in Microsoft Intune. To configure enrollment notifications in Microsoft Endpoint Manager, first you need to log in with one of the global administrator accounts or Intune administrator account. And once you are logged in, go to devices. If you want to configure enrollment notifications for Windows devices, you will click Windows and then click Windows enrollment. And here you will get option enrollment notifications. From here, you can configure enrollment notifications only for Windows devices. But let's say you want to configure enrollment notifications for other platforms. If you want to configure it for iOS or iPad operating system devices, click on this option and go to iOS iPad operating system enrollment. And here you will get the option for enrollment notifications. As of now, this particular option and these four options are grayed out because we haven't enabled Apple MDM push certificate in our tenant. Once we have the push certificate enabled, after that, these four options will be accessible. Same way, if you want to configure enrollment notifications for Mac operating system, you will go to Mac OS enrollment. And from here, you can configure enrollment notifications. Again, you need to configure the push certificate first. And if you want to do it for Android devices, you will go to Android enrollment. And here, you will get enrollment notifications for Android devices. So for this demo, we are going to create enrollment notifications for Windows devices. So under by platform, we will click Windows. And here we will click Windows enrollment. And here we will click enrollment notifications. So here it says Windows notifications. That means from here, from this particular window, you can configure enrollment notifications only for Windows devices. So to create enrollment notifications, you will click create notifications and here we will give it a name Windows 
enroll notifications and click next. If you want, you can add a description as well. Click next. Now here you will get two options, push notification and email notification. If you want to enable push notification, simply turn it on. Here you can type a subject, for example, welcome to Office 365 concepts. And here you can type the message. For example, you have successfully enrolled your Windows machine. For example, like this you can add. Next is email notification. You can turn it on from here. And here you can type a subject for the email that will be sent to the user once that user will enroll his device successfully. Now here, if you want to add a message using HTML code, you can turn this option to on and you can write the message here in this particular window in HTML format or you can type the message in a plain text. You can turn it off and here you can type a message like this and next is email header which is the actual body of the email if you want that your company logo should reflect within the email you can turn this option to on now these settings are coming from customization that we did in one of the previous videos if we go to tenant administration and go to customization you can see this customization and company branding that we configured you can see the organization name. You can see the company logo. And here you can see the admin details or the IT support contact details. Now here you can see the logo. Here you can configure if you want to show device details within the email, like the device operating system, which device was enrolled by the user, the version of operating system, model name of the device, serial number of the device and the device name. So if you want to show these details within the email, you can turn this option to on. And next is show company name. Yes, I want to show company name within the email. Show contact information. Now this information is for your IT support team that is configured here within the company branding. So make sure before you configure enrollment notifications, this company branding policy should be configured in your Microsoft Intune tenant. Next is show company portal website link. If you want to show your company portal website link within the email, turn this option to on. And once you have made the changes, click next. No changes required here. So here you can add a security group of the users or you can assign this policy to all the users of your tenant. So let's create a security group. new group and give it a name for example enrollment notifications and let's add a couple of users as members so i'll add these two users and click create so the group is created let's go back and click add group look for the group here enrollment notifications select the group is added click next review the changes and click create so the enrollment notifications policy for windows devices is created and we have enabled email and push notification and this is assigned to a security group so now when users will enroll their windows devices the users who are part of the security group which is assigned within this policy those users when they will enroll their devices they will get the notifications so this is how you can set up enrollment notifications in microsoft intune in the next video we will be talking about enrollment status page or esp so that is all for now i'll see you all in the next video thank you guys thank you for your time take care